Party people, party people, can you get funky? Yo, what's up? I'm B-Boy Spidey, also known as Dr. T. That's my rap name. So, uh, what you wanna know? Just hit me. Just hit me. What's up, people? This is B-Boy Lays. I'm 16 years old. I'm in Bakersfield. Uh, my crews are Breakdown Crew, TVB, Vataholics, Walking City Crew. Yeah, that's my crews. Stay repping every day. Yo, what's up everybody? This is B-Boy Shaky. I'm out here in Bakersfield. I'm the head leader of the Breakdown Crew, also a member of Air Force, Walk On City Crew, Paraholics, and the Bronx Boys Rocking Crew. I've been a B-Boy since B-Boy started. Uh, Actually, I actually uh, seen it when I was probably like six years old when I first moved into the Valley View Apartments in uh, Delano, California. Uh, I was like six years old uh, when I first moved there and uh, I wasn't even first grade actually, I was still in kindergarten. Uh, they were break dancing in the, in, in, the, in the laundromat actually, right there outside the laundromat. And um, I seen all these guys with different colors, they looked like cholos, um, you know, just different style of cholos though, you know, like with different colored rags and different, you know, they were just all hyped up and, you know, there was guys out there popping, there was guys out there, you know, uh, moonwalking, and, and then you had those guys with the, with the cardboard, you know, so back in the days they, had, they used cardboard, the cardboard came from, from the refrigerators and then they just take these up and then, uh, you know, they set it on the floor we didn't have anything like, like what, uh, what all the studios and stuff like that have nowadays, we, we were break dancing on cardboard. And uh, you know, uh, it came a long ways now. And uh, pretty much back in the days, uh, like 1983, 84 is when I started. You know, um, I'm 34 now, so. just about four years. My first inspiration, uh, first I didn't like me boy. Uh, the first person I saw breakdancing was my brother. Uh, I thought it looked goofy, he was all that great. But then he got better, people started liking it, he was enjoying himself, and that, that dragged me in. And that was keeping him off, off a lot of bad stuff. It started setting him on the right track, uh, made him more independent. And I, and I love that because I was kind of heading the wrong road and then he introduced me into breaking and he started teaching me and along the road I got to meet more people so my big inspiration, my first inspiration was my brother Vivo Shaking. Don't, don't quit. It's, if you think it's too hard it's just because you're not practicing enough. You gotta practice, practice, practice. Practice makes perfect. Just keep your head strong. Don't ever think, oh, it's too hard, or I need more muscle. It's not really about the muscle. It's about, it's about practicing, and it's about the movement, the way you move. It's technique and practice, dedication. And that's, that's how you really get good, dedication. Bounce and pounce.
up, so hit me. Just taste the funk and hit me. Just get on down and hit me. Man, Bob, just get so fucking and hit me. Other of the world. Where's the message of my world? All oh, them women, boys, and girls. Hey, our planet rocks is so working it. on it. it. You got the groove. Move, shaboom, do, tattoo, shout, feel the groove. Feel it. Do what you want to, but you know you got to be cool and boogie. Out on the floor. Go down, bring it low. Close to the ground. And everybody just rocking, don't stop. I've been a b-boy for a little bit over nine years. Well, I was in the sixth grade. The first dancer that I saw, first b-boy, was uh, Dunok from Super Crew. Uh, then I was self-taught for five years, and then I just went off of that. Um, for, there's a lot of people out there who, who, who need a way to, to uh, release that energy that they have inside, and, and uh, to me, this was it. Uh, one big thing about it is that if you're going to learn how to break, make sure that you're keeping up with your history as well, uh, because that's something very important to all the OGs as you're coming up. Uh, learn your moves and learn your history. I recommend uh, look it up on YouTube, even if you just type in B-Boy here in B-Town. Uh, there's the gate. It's on 21st and O on Thursdays from 7 to 9 p.m. Uh, pretty much the b-boys who are already doing it here in town, uh, they go there. That's pretty much like the spot for everybody. Uh, but uh, it's all about expressing your soul, expressing who you really are. Peace. <laughs> boys who are still, b-boys and b-girls who are still practicing or doing their thing, my respect. All those people who want to start, you should start. And there's no judging in the b-boy community. Community, everybody does it. Everybody loves it. It's a very, it's a very good vibe. Cool. Adios. Uh, <laughs> well, I like to tell a lot of the B boys that B boys are funny. <laughs> We are some funny characters, and, 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 and that's what makes us stand out. Hey, you know, be a universal b-boy. Learn how to dance uh, choreography. Learn how to dance, uh, you know, club dancing. Learn how to dance any type of dance because it's going to help you out as being a b-boy. You know, to say uh, um, to my little boys, Ty, Alex, and Andrew, I love you guys, and I'm coming for you. Hey, what's going on, B-Boys out there? I just want to say uh, thank you guys for making me number one. Um, I've been in Breakdown for about three years now. They passed the torch to me, so uh, Breakdown Crew is number one. I'm number one. I'll battle you, your mom, your sister, brother, cousin, ne niece, nephew, sister's dog. I'm ready. Break down pretty much. Working all around the clock. Everybody keep rocking and clocking and shocking and rocking. Go house. Everybody say rocking, don't stop it.